And then we saw a shift with E3s recently, where it was, all right, shoe's not going to come out. You're barely going to come out. It's just going to be trailers, and that's how we're going to run it. Mm -hmm. And it felt like, ooh, are we going back to a PlayStation 3 era, era PlayStation that wants to be more behind the scenes, or...? Uh. No, I'm, I'm not sure what you mean by behind the scenes, but um, I think we found that we have this great opportunity every year now with PSX mm -hmm. to have this kind of, let's get by the fireside up close and personal, and let's you know, speak our truths and tell our stories. And I think E3, really, it's a trade show. Yeah. That's what it is, it's a trade show. And we have such great content lined up for that. I really felt, why would I, I don't need to come up and say, on the next scene you're going to see, um, Bob is having a little trouble with his son, and he wants to go over here and get, get a kill an alligator. You know, you just show you what it is, right? And put it up is on that the game in development? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, just having so many problems with my son. It's because of the alligator. <laughs> Let's go, boy. Yeah. Um, so, are we, are we shouting out greatest hits? Or? I think they yelled out karaoke. I don't understand. <laughs> they don't, they understand. So I think I think this is what PlayStation Experience is, is trying to be is to is, is to be that real connected, engaged um, a moment. You know, for the next couple of days, not only we go on the floor and you're going to be able to see um, some great game play and, and some there'll be a lot of demos there as well. But you also there's some a lot of experiential stuff. I think maybe you're going to go in there and think that is this a is this a game show? Or is this a trade? Is this a theme park? Right. Mm -hmm. And um, we want to get you closer to the visions that the creators have for their games and why they make and why they do what they do. You'll see a lot of the development teams and, and creators you know, on the floor themselves you know, enjoying uh, what we're going to do here the next couple of days. And you know, I hope to meet a lot of you as I'm, as I'm warming the floor as well. This is the kind of show you want to do. E3 is really, it's kind of glitzy, but it's right there. You, 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 want, to, you want to tell that story. You want to make that mark to say, this is what PlayStation games are all about. Pow, 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 pow. What did you think of E3 being open to consumers this year? I thought, I'll be honest with you guys, I think uh, the ESA had sold 15,000 consumer tickets for that. And it really brought the crowd to the edge of pain. Yeah. And um, I won't bore you guys with the, with the details around it, but if you're going to design a trade show or a consumer show, there's a completely two different beasts. And the way you do it, not only physically, the way you have to make rows wider, you have to have those experience shorter to get more people through. Um, we have to determine, you know, E3 is like, in the middle of the highway is going to get hit by cars on both sides now. Yeah. So it's got, to, it's got to choose a lane to be in. Yeah, that's not the way to drive. <laughs>